we make many journeys in our lives and each one has a unique memory attached to it. No two journeys are ever the same and that's what makes them so unique and special. They teach us to make memories that we cherish through our lives. Someone rightly said, Sometimes it's the journey itself that teaches us a lot about our destination. As a human being, all we seek is a pleasant feeling. No matter what our circumstances look like or what situations we are in, how busy our schedule might be, how ambitious dreams we have or what struggles we are going through. One thing is common in all of us. We all seek pleasantness, consciously or subconsciously. If we understand the art of memory making, we can preserve those pleasant memories for longer to cherish and feel good about whenever the time calls for it. There are different ways to make a happy memory, but oftentimes we get too picky to find and wait for that special moment that we miss on the opportunities that universe is giving us every single day. And that's only possible if we allow ourselves to look from that perspective. Beauty is found everywhere to make happy memories. All it requires is your attention. There are different ways to outsource a memory, like writing, sketching, recording, taking pictures, or even collecting specimens. I tend to create my own journal so I can customize it as per my needs. because I like to do a mix of everything when it comes to journaling and memory making. I like to sketch and draw that catches my attention or write about my thoughts 
the stories about the places I visit. I also collect the tickets, the receipts, photographs, and little specimens like flowers, leaves, or feathers as a token of memory. Making my own journal makes it extra special as I'm putting my emotions and excitement to it before going on a trip. These little things may sound small, but they create huge impact in the way we remember our experiences. After all, joy is to be found in little things around us. So why not grab as many opportunities as possible? As it is said, we do not remember days, we remember moments. All these life experiences and memories, finding joy in little things, gives a life its meaning. And that's the real meaning of life. Or, as I call it, the realm of life. I am visiting a place in Scottish Highland which goes by the name of Loch Lomond. There is a folk song, Pony Banks of Loch Lomond, inspired by the irresistible beauty of this place. The song Loch Lomond tells the story of two Scottish soldiers who were imprisoned and one of them was to be set free while the another one was to be executed. According to the Celtic legend, if someone dies in a foreign land, their spirit will travel to his homeland by the low road, the route for the souls of the dead. In the song, the spirit of the dead soldier arrives first, while the living soldier takes the high road over the mountains to arrive afterwards. The song is from the point of view of the soldier who is to be executed says that he will return in spirit to Loch Lomond. He remembers all his happy memories that he created there in the past and he believes that even after we die, memories will remain alive ever after. Closing with a saying of Buddha, one day we will be just a memory for some people, so let's do our best to be a good one.